friends. So today is going to be my much awaited, much awaited, uh, my answers video since last week I said to ask me questions and today I'm going to answer them all. I'm sorry, my hair feels funny. Uh, okay, it's fine. It's just going to have to deal with itself because I don't feel like fixing it and it's just, I don't, I can't. So I actually got way more questions than I was expecting, so I'm not going to be able to answer all of them. But if I don't answer a question that you asked in this video, you can ask it again in the comments of this video and I will definitely answer it for you. Let's go. First off, my favorite color. It's green, which is actually surprising because I don't have a lot of green, well, I guess I do have a lot of green things. I don't know, I don't have a lot of green and I don't wear a lot of green, but it's my favorite color. It's always been my favorite color. I also really like pink. Favorite music? I listen to a lot of different kinds of music and I'm usually very open to all sorts of different kinds of music. My favorite band is called Of Monsters and Men and my favorite song overall is King and Lionheart by Of Monsters and Men, but some other favorite bands that I have are Icy Stars, Owl City, and This Wildlife. Can you explain the universe in one word? To sort of describe the universe in one word, I would just say big because it really is and I know that's kind of boring I wish I had like some profound thing to say but I would just say it's big you know there's so much in the universe and we really don't know what everything is in the universe so I would just go with that the universe is big what is my goal in life or slash where do I want my future to go or wh where do I see myself or things like that? You know, I really hope that eventually I have a job that is really, really fun for me to do. Maybe that's animation, maybe it's not, I don't know. Hopefully that will allow me to work from home because I'm a homebody. I would like to have a little house with a big pasture for a couple of horses so that they can just live out there in the field and live their little life. I want to have my house surrounded in just copious amounts of flowers and dogs. That's it. And to be happy. Like, I want to be happy. Do I believe in the Mandela effect? I do. I believe in a lot of conspiracy theories. I'm very into conspiracy theories. It's kind of weird. Favorite childhood toy is this little stuffed animal. Her name is Sneaky and she's a beanie baby. And it's a very, very long story, but this is actually the third Sneaky. And I also have like over 20 Sneakies, but she's the third and the first two are no longer with us, so. It's a very sore subject, yeah. <laughs> but this is Sneaky and she is my favorite childhood toy. <laughs> favorite book series, Warriors. I'm still 13 on the inside and I really like Warriors. In fact, I just bought three of the um, the hardcover, the special books. I like Warriors, sorry, not sorry. Uh, how old am I? Every time I get asked this, I say yes. Sometimes I get just the weirdest responses like 12, 14, something like that. Sometimes I get actually pretty close to my age or my actual age, but I'm I am 19 and my birthday is March 18th. It's lit. Favorite movie is The Lion King. Still my favorite movie, been my favorite movie for a very long time. Nothing else to say about that. Who do I live with? Uh, this was a little bit of a confusing thing. Some people thought that I lived just with my boyfriend or if we live separately, like with our parents. I live down here in Florida in this house. So this room is our room and we live here and we pay to live here. And then my parents live here and my three little siblings live here as well as our pets, all everyone's pets. So I do live with my boyfriend, but we also live with my parents and his parents are up north. I was asked, what do I mean when I would say, oh, I'm going going to appointments, trying to figure out what's wrong with me. I don't usually say a whole lot about that. I have some very weird health issues that I have been dealing with for a while and been trying to get answers for them. And up north, I was steered in a lot of different directions, really not giving me any answers. And when I came down here, I am fortunate to be close to somewhere called the Mayo Clinic, which is a big clinic. They're known for you know, figuring out some very complex uh, health issues. So I am going there, I will be going there um, periodically over the next three months for different tests to see different specialists to see if they can give me some answers. Who's my favorite YouTuber slash who do I admire most? I'm gonna say they're both the same person, although I admire a bunch of different people, but my favorite YouTuber is Jenna Marbles and I do admire her a lot. She's definitely one of my biggest role models, so I'm gonna sort of put that out there and leave it at that. What is Penny's full name? Her full name is Penny Blossom. She was named after Penny from the Big Bang Theory, specifically the episode where they talk about Penny's little business like Penny Blossoms and then like those little brets that she makes, so Penny's named after that. Are my cat siblings? They are Simba and 
Simba and Snickers. Uh, our brother and sister, what are my deepest thoughts? Honestly, I my brain is always moving. I'm thinking about a million different things all the time, constantly, and it's really exhausting. I think about very profound things. I get into very existential moments of my life where I question a lot of very important things, and then I also go down to the level of thinking about what kind of memes I can animate in my free time. I think a lot about the characters that I create and how I can develop them better and what kind of story I can put them in. I think a lot about that and I think a lot about dogs. If I could be any animal in the world, what would I be? I would be a fox. It's like my my animal, that's like my thing. I used to be a cheetah for the longest time. I grew up loving cheetahs. Don't really relate to the cheetahs anymore, so foxes. What is my favorite ice cream flavor? Chocolate. I'm pretty boring. I like chocolate ice cream. I like chocolate everything. I'm a girl. Sorry, girls that don't like chocolate. Specifically, I really like the Ben & Jerry's dairy-free brownie ice cream or whatever it is. I don't actually know exactly what it is, but all I know is it's great and it's done with almond milk and it tastes really good and that's my favorite ice cream. Would you rather it rain sprinkles or confetti? Confetti. I just feel like if it was raining sprinkles, one would get in my eye and it would hurt really bad, but confetti I feel like I can handle. Also, it would always be like the universe is throwing you a party and I feel like I could use a lot of that in my life, personally. Confetti. If you were to dye your hair any color, what would you do? If you've ever seen the X-Files, Scully has this really nice red hair and I'm thinking about doing my whole head in that. I would also like to dye my hair like actual bright red and purple. I wouldn't dye it permanently. Do I wanna have tattoos? Yes, I do. I really, really wanna have tattoos. I think they're really pretty. The first one I wanna get is, well, not one. It's multiple tattoos I wanna get initially, which is my back, the majority of it covered in stars and I would really like to do that. This was my favorite question. This was the question that stumped me the most. It was so, it was such a question that needed to be answered. If you ate yourself, would you get twice as big or disappear? I don't know. And that really bothers me because I can't answer that question. I hope someone out there can answer it because I can't and it's really bothering me. I need an answer for that. I can't do it. So this is a PSA, answer that question for me. That's all. Okay, they subscribe to our channel. We make new videos every, bye. Make new videos every Friday. Always something going on over here, I don't know. It's, it's weird. That was Simba signing off, being a freaking meme. You're a freaking meme. He's offended. I will see you guys next week. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.